Hello. Words you need для нормально общающихся. Lesson 15. Remember, in the last three lessons of the course, so that's the last 150 words, uh, we are focusing on cognates. Cognates are words which are more or less the same in two languages. So, all of these words are nearly the same in English and Russian, which means that you don't need to learn them. You already know them. But it is worth working on pronunciation, and that's what we are going to do together. So, the first one. Нам нужно адаптироваться к нашей новой реальности. We need to adapt to our new reality. Sorry, it took me a moment there to sort out my voice typing. Um, we need to adapt. Adaptiravatsa. I wonder what other... Ah, we've got another sentence with adapt. Она быстро адаптировалась к своему новому окружению. She adapted quickly to her new surroundings. So, adaptiravatsa to adapt. Just remember, a, a, when you're pronouncing the first syllable, a, start smiling because you need to adapt. Pronounce the da with stretched lips. Adapt. Adapt. We also talk about adaptations. These birds have some adaptations which make them ideally suited to life on this island. So, adaptations, uh, ways that people adapt or animals adapt. The next one, по окончании курса вы получите сертификат. You will receive a certificate at the end of the course. So, сертификат is a certificate, certificate, the stress is on the t, but the is not pronounced with our full voice because it comes between two unvoiced consonants. Tiff, tiff, certificate at the end of the course. Certificate, certificate. There's also a, a verb. This certificate certifies that the holder has completed a first aid course. So it certifies. The next one. Alternatively rock, my любимый genre. Obviously this is a French word. Alternative rock is my favorite genre. Now this is a particularly unusual word in English because it begins with a z. I think it's one of the only ones. Genre, genre. There are very few words that begin with z. Genre. And we pronounce it with an ah, ja, ja, genre, genre. Hold the n as well, genre, genre. My favorite genre. Some people who uh, want to show off genre might try to pronounce it with a French pronunciation. That sounds ridiculous. Genre. Uh, the next one. Anna designer interiorov. She is an interior designer. So, interiere, interior, interior. Uh, so, exteriere, exterior. Nope. Exterior, interior. Just remember, ear, this sound in the middle, it's an it, it sound. Exterior. Exterior, exterior, interior, interior, interior. The next one. Я смотрел интервью с президентом по телевизору. I watched an interview with the president on TV. Interview. So the stress is on the in at the beginning. Interview. In. Make sure you open your mouth so it's not in, but in interview it, 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 it. open your mouth interview don't if your tongue is right at the top e, you'll get e 
E, 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 E. It is like an E, but then E. You have to open your mouth. Interview. The next one. У меня брал интервью местный репортер. I was interviewed by a local reporter. Interviewed. So it's also a verb. You can interview someone. Uh, to interview, an interview. The next one, it's a verb. Мы позировали для фотосессии. Или просто для одну фото. We posed for a photo. I don't know why it says фотосессия in the translation here. That's a bit strange. Фотосессия, кстати, is a photo shoot. I had a photo shoot yesterday. So, фотосессия, photo shoot. I don't like posing. Uh, sometimes we also say about a person, oh, he's a poser. So, if someone's a poser, um, he's a poser. They like um, showing off their image, I would say. He's a, po he's a poser. It's not a compliment to say someone's a poser. Interestingly, you can also pose a question. So, задайте вопрос is to pose a question. He posed some difficult questions. Not opposed. He, he posed. There we go. He posed some difficult questions. When you pronounce pose, make sure you get a lot of w in it. Po w -w 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 -w. Posed. Posed some difficult questions. Next. Uh, also pose. Primite другую позу. Make a different pose. Lots of w. Pose. Like nose. This, uh, those words rhyme. Nose, pose. The next one. Я много пользуюсь социальными сетями. I use social media a lot. So, социальные сети, social media. Social. In this word, so, there's also a w sound. Social. But it's clipped before the sh, the unvoiced sh. So, so, social. It's the same sound that we have in soap. Soap, social. Soap, social. The next one. Я изучила эту дыхательную технику на своих занятиях йогой. I learned this breathing technique in my yoga classes. Now, in this case, техника is technique, because a technique in English is a way of doing something. So, I learned this way of breathing. I learned this technique. But, Russian, техника, в смысле, оборудование, um, is not. Uh, техника, in that case, is machinery. Machinery. I bought some new machinery for the factory or maybe for the workshop if it's a bit smaller. So that could be technica. Butovaya technica are household appliances. This store sells household appliances. Um, so machinery, if it's, I don't know, for cutting um, things, uh, the kind of stuff you'd find in a workshop or a factory. Um, appliances for бытовая техника. But техника в смысле способ что-то делать. That's a technique. Technique. Next. Я никогда раньше не слышал этого термина. I have never heard that term before. Термин, a term. We often talk about T and... Oops. Where is it? I'll do it like that. That's not how we usually write it. Oh, it's there. Uh, T and C's. That's terms and conditions. Термины и условия. Terms and conditions. 
terms, 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 terms. Okay, the next one. Я использую последнюю версию приложения. Версия is a version. I am using the latest version of the app. Version. Remember with the er uh sound, everything goes forward. Lips and the middle of the tongue. Version. Version. The latest version of the app. All right, that's the first set of 10 in today's lesson. So feel free to press pause, take a break, review the sentences. Okay, part two. Uh, number 711. Они не могут арестовать его. They can't arrest him. Арестовать? Arrest. Трое мужчин были арестованы. Three men were arrested. Arrested. You need to go ar, lips forward, arrest, and then move them back very quickly. Arrested. Arrested. The next one, я люблю экстремальные виды спорта. Экстремальные is extreme. I love extreme sports. Try again with voice typing. Didn't work. I love extreme sports. There we go. Extreme. Extreme. Uh, let's look at some other things that can be extreme. We also have extreme weather. Some people live in extreme poverty. That's people who are extremely poor. This is an extreme example of what I mean. Um, extreme heat. You get the idea. Extreme. Remember to uh, pronounce a lot of y. Extreme. Extreme. Y. You need lots of y. Extreme. Extreme. The next one. У него отличное чувство юмора. He has a great sense of humor. I like this word. There are not many words like this. When the h huh sound is pronounced with our tongue. Usually, h huh is in the throat. But in this word, humor, we pronounce it with our tongue in our mouth. Humor. Humor. He has a great sense of humor. Let's have a look if there are any other words like this. So words that start H-U. Of course, there are. For example, human. Huge. And humor. I think they're the only ones. Human, huge, humor. H in your mouth. Um, hu, hu, interesting. Heat. We also do this in our mouth with words like heat, heat, um, or heap. So before E and U, we say human heat. Human heat. A huge human. Uh, I hope that was interesting for you. Next. Она эксперт по инфекционным заболеваниям. She is an expert in infectious diseases. Infectious. Infectious. Remember that the e is stressed, but it's clipped between the foot and the cut. Infectious. Infe fe infectious diseases, not in work. Infectious, infectious. The next one. Это кажется логичным решением. It seems like a logical decision. Logical, logical. So the logic. Logical, or here, on действовал логично, 
he acted logically. You must start l with your mouth open. Logic. Lo lo logically. Logically. Not log. Lo logical. Logical. If something is нелогично, это был нелогичный поступок. It was an illogical thing to do. It was illogical. L -l 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 really important to pronounce the L with an open mouth. Illogical. The next one. Корабль подорвался на мине. The ship hit a mine. Or, the soldiers had to go through a minefield. So that's minnaya polya, a minefield. Mine, minefield. Interestingly, in English, mine is, is mina, but also shachta. That's also a mine. So, let's try this sentence. The miners are in a minefield. That's shakhtyore v minnei polia. The next one. On na staranye apazitsi. He is on the side of the opposition. Apazitsi. Opposition. Opposition. Not o, but o. O. Opposition. Opposition. It's really important to pronounce the stressed o with an open mouth. Opposition. The next one, oh, this is a word many people get wrong. Я знаю отличный рецепт приготовления ризота. I know a great recipe for risotto. Recipe, very unusual word. It looks like it should be recipe, but we call it a recipe. 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 A recipe for risotto. Very unusual word. Recipe. Recipe. The next one. Нефть и газ являются важными природными ресурсами. Ресурсы. Oil and gas are important natural resources. Ресурсы. Resources. Or resources. Uh, both pronunciations are possible. Resources and resources. Some people say resources. Some people say resources. 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 The next one. Строительные проекты требуют большого количества стали. Стали is steel. Construction projects require a lot of steel. They didn't steal the steel. Interesting, these two words are pronounced exactly the same. Steel, ukrest, steel, style. They didn't steal the steel. Uh, steel. If something is made of steel, we also just say steel. So a steel, what can be made of steel? Let's have a look. For example, ah. The steel industry. So, man, the production of steel. A steel mill. That's a place, that's like a, a factory where steel is made. It can be called a steel mill. A steel door. Uh, obviously, that's dear. Interestingly, mill, usually a mill is a place where bread, uh, no, where grain is milled. So usually it's Mielnitsa. Ah, that's also a kind of cognate. Mielnitsa mill. Miel mill. Yeah. Um, but steel mill, we also use this word. Uh, all right, that's another set of 10. So feel free to take this opportunity to have a little break. Or if you stay with me, I'm going to talk about another set of 10 now. So number 721. Nasha Tsilavaya Auditoria Padrostkia. Auditoria is audience. Our target audience is teenagers. Audience, make sure you pronounce it with an, a double or or. 
at the beginning. Audience. 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 The next one. Ana fsigda kritikuyet minya. She always criticizes me. She criticizes. The noun is criticism. Ya nie magu prinimait kritiko. I can't accept criticism. Uh, another sentence. Eta politika podvirglas kritike sa starani eksperta. The policy was criticized by experts. And there's also a noun, critics. Onda kazal što jevo kritike ashe balis. He proved his critics wrong. Improved. There, he proved his critics wrong. So, to criticize. Criticism. Critics. Uh, the stress is always at the start. I think criticize, criticism, critics. Always on the first syllable. That means always crit. Open your mouth. Criticize, criticism, critics. Not cri, cri, cri. Criticize, criticism, critics. Next. Oh, it's another one. Ana kriticzki odnosiła się k swoim kolegom. She is critical of her colleagues. That obviously comes from criticize. There is also another use of the word critical. The situation is critical. Now that's a secondary meaning and sytuacja krytyczna. Um so it's an emergency. It's an emergency. So a critical situation is an emergency, but uh, critical commentary is negative. Or critical comments, I should probably say. Uh, okay, ona prodemonstrowała, że to jest możliwe zrobić. She demonstrated that it can be done. Prodemonstrirovat, she demonstrated. Stress on the first syllable, demonstrated. But the noun, pasmatriti eta demonstratio. Watch this demonstration. Uh, for example, I don't know, on the aeroplane, uh, at the beginning of the flight, the cabin crew do a demonstration of how to put on life jackets. Uh, there's another use of demonstration, uh, which is Bolshoi meeting can also be called a demonstration. So, there was a huge demonstration. Um, what what sort of things? I don't know. There was a huge anti-war demonstration. So, that's like a march where lots of people go out to the street. Next, my sister, dentist. It's dentist. I honestly didn't know that it was Dan dentist, not dentist. How interesting. My sister is a dentist. I honestly, I always thought it was like that. I always thought it was dentist, not dentist. That's interesting. Anyway, in English, dentist, a dentist. Den, den, den. Smile, dentist. She's a dentist. Um... She does dental work. The dentist does dental work. Actually, stomatolog, we also use the word dentist. Um, we, we rarely talk about stomatologists. Uh, we talk about orthodontists um, and dentists. So dental specialists are usually dentists or orthodontists. My brother is a dentist and my sister is an is an orthodontist. Got it. Next, у нее хорошая фигура. She has a nice figure. And uh, figurное катание is 
figure skating. Мне нравится фигурное катание. I like figure skating. No, not bigger skating. <laughs> I like figure skating. Got it. Figure. There we go. Uh, the next one. Мне нравится его менталитет. I like his mentality. So, he has a, a good approach. I like his mentality. Mentalitet. The next one. Регуляционные правила были изменены. Регуляционные правила. The, the regulations have been changed. So, there's this verb to regulate. For example... Industria azartnik igar stroga regulirutsa. The gambling industry is highly regulated. Regulated. So we talk about regulations, we talk about regulating things. Revolutsia. Ruskia revolutsia prezeshla v simnatstam gadu. Ili aktiabrskaya revolutsia. The Russian Revolution happened in 1917. Obviously, in, in Russia, it's not called Ruskaya Revolutsia, Aktyabrskaya Revolutsia, I guess. But um, we call it the Russian, the Russian Revolution. Revolution. Oh, we've had the Aktyabrskaya Revolutsia, now we've got Lenin. В центре площади стоит статуа Ленина. Статуа... There is a statue of Lenin in the center of the square. <laughs> Great. Lenin. John Lennon? No, not John Lennon. <laughs> Let's try again. There is a statue of Lenin in the middle of the square. No, it's not Lenin. It's Lenin. It's Vladimir Ilyich Lenin. <laughs> Impossible. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, apparently voice typing doesn't like Lenin. Maybe American accent. It's Lenin. No, it's not Lenin. It's Lenin. <laughs> no, I can't do it. Uh, voice typing refuses to identify the word or to recognize the word Lenin. Never mind. Uh, we are actually looking at the word statue, aren't we? Statue. Stat, 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 statue. It's another ST which is pronounced st. Statue. Statue. With a smile. Statue. And the next one, the last one in part three of the lesson. Я принимаю витаминную таблетку перед каждым приемом пищи. I take a vitamin tablet before every meal. A tablet. Smile. Ta, ta, ta. Tablet. Tablet. So, that's another set of ten. Well done. Uh, take a break and uh, come back soon to watch the next part of the lesson. Part 4 Он одарён в академическом плане. He is academically gifted. So, uh, we also talk about academia. He works in academia. Um, which is в науке. Uh, наука is академия. Not only science. That's a mistake people sometimes make. Uh, they think, oh, наука это science. Usually science is, for us, естественные науки. There is also um, social sciences and political sciences, but on the whole, science means естественные науки, uh, but наука is академия. He's academically gifted, а в академическом плане. The next one. У меня на компьютере много аудиофайлов. I have a lot of audio files on my computer. 
So audio is audio. Oh, oh, oh. Lips forward, audio, double sound, audio. Americans say audio, ah, 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 audio. Audio, 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 audio. The next one, фейковые новости, это относительно новая концепция. Fake news is a relatively new concept. So, концепция, concept, concept. Co -co -co open your mouth, concept, concept. This one's about Mendeleev. I wonder if uh, voice typing will cope better with Mendeleev than it coped with... Lenin. Mendeleev создал таблицу элементов. Mendeleev created a table of elements. No, it was not Mandela. <laughs> Nelson Mandela. Mendeleev created a table of elements. Should we try it with Russian pronunciation? Mendeleev Created a table of elements. <laughs> nope, nope, it can't cope with uh, Mendeleev either. Mendeleev created a table of elements. Anyway, this is about elements, not Mendeleev. Elements, element of element. Eh, eh, eh. Open your mouth, smile, elements. У нее все еще проблемы с элементарной логикой. She still has problems with elementary logic. Lots of cognates there. Problems, проблемы, elementary, элементарной, logic, логика. The next one. В галерее проходит выставка Ван Гога. There is a Van Gogh exhibition at the gallery. So it can cope with Van Gogh. There we go. Interesting that we call him Van Gogh. Uh, and you call him Van Gogh. I think it's actually Van Gogh or something like that in Dutch. But um, we call him Van Gogh. A Van Gogh exhibition at the gallery. But again, we're not talking about Van Gogh. We're talking about the gallery. G -g Open your mouth. Gallery, not gallery. Ga, ga, gallery. Show everybody your tongue. Gallery, gallery. Next. Сегодня утром на мосту произошел незначительный инцидент. There was a minor incident on the bridge this morning. Incident. Maybe you remember in the very first lesson of the course we had the word совпадение, a coincidence. So that's two things, um, two incidents that happen at the same time. A coincidence is two simultaneous incidents. Um, there's also a phrase incidents of... I wonder what nouns we'll get for this. So we sometimes talk about incidents of when we talk about diseases, so in healthcare. The incidence of cancer has fallen uh, with a CE at the end. Or the incidence of diabetes is rising. Or incidents like that, incidents of, incidents. The incidence of heart disease is going down. Incidence. Like that, incidence of. Okay, the next one. Эта вода содержит несколько полезных минералов. This water contains some useful minerals. Minerals. Stress on the first syllable. Min. Minerals. So stretch the ma. Minerals. Mineral water. Минеральная вода. Эта новость нанесет ущерб его репутации. This news will damage his reputation. Reputation. Uh, what's interesting here is that there's a little y after the p. Re p y. The the r is really small. Tation. Oops. 
This should be normal text. Reputation. Reputation. So remember to pronounce the y. Sometimes people miss it because it's not there in the Russian word. But reputation. Reputation. It will damage his reputation. What other verbs are done to people's reputations? Shall we have a look? Reputation. For this we'll need collocates and verbs which come before and after. So you can, let's have this one, you can, he earned a reputation. What? Try again. He earned a reputation for generosity. He gained a reputation for cruelty. He built a reputation for reliability. He established a reputation for punctuality. Uh, so, some different uh, verbs that are often used with reputation. Okay, the next one. Они устроили мне виртуальную экскурсию по квартире. Виртуальную. They gave me a virtual tour of the apartment. Virtual. I think we're going to talk about this more and more uh, during the next few years. Virtual reality. Now, you know, maybe... Maybe you've tried these goggles. I've never tried virtual reality goggles. Um, I know my son, he hasn't tried it yet either, but he's very keen to try virtual reality gaming. Anyway, pronunciation, remember, vir, uh, 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 it's the uh, uh, forward sound, uh, and then chul, ch -ch -ch, with a ch, virtual, virtual, virtual reality. Uh, the next one, number 740, этот вирус очень заразен. Obviously, everybody knows the word, but many people don't pronounce it correctly. This virus is very contagious. Virus. Va -va -va virus is very contagious. Virus. Open your mouth. Virus. Vi. By virus, not just virus. Of course, if you say virus, virus, everybody will understand you, but it is not correct. Virus, virus. And uh, virusny content is viral content. Хочу создавать virusny content. I want to create viral content. Virus, viral. That's another set of ten, so this is your chance to press pause and review the vocabulary. Or if you like, stay with me and uh, we'll look at the last ten words in this lesson together. Мне нравятся анимационные фильмы. I enjoy animated movies. Animated. And people who make animated movies are called animators. She is training to be an animator. Of course, animator is not animator, because an animator, who works with children, uh, is an entertainer. Uh, we hired a great entertainer for my son's party. That would be animator, entertainer. An animator animates films. The next one. Мне нравится немного хаоса. I enjoy a bit of chaos. Now here is an example of words which obviously come from the same root, but the pronunciation is actually quite different. Chaos, chaos. So it's k, k, or even with the Russian air, k, os. Chaos. Chaos. And it's a double stressed word, I would say. Chaos. 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 Um, chaotichny budget chaotic. The selection process was chaotic. 
So chaos, chaotic, chaos, chaotic. Um, let's look at the next one. Мы фантастически провели время во Франции. Фантастически. We had a fantastic time in France. But while talking about the word fantastic, I also need to talk about the word fantasy because they're a bit different. So fantasy, fantasy, that's the word we use to talk about books, films, for example. I like fantasy films like Harry Potter. It's a fantasy, a fantasy film. Um, there's also sci-fi, which is science fiction. Uh, that would be things like Star Wars. So Star Wars will have uh, uh, science fiction. Fantasy, we can have Harry Potter. You know, it's about magic. But fantastic just means really good. So you could say, I watched a fantastic fantasy film. So um, fantastic, really good. Fantasy is the genre, the type of film. The next one. Fierwierki byli впечатляющими. The fireworks display was spectacular. Fireworks. Remember, it's a word which consists of two nouns, fire and work. So the stress, as always, is on the first. Fireworks. The fireworks display. Fireworks. Fire. Fire. Fireworks display was spectacular. The next one. Хорошая погода гарантирована. Good weather is guaranteed. Um, we also talk about a, a guarantee. Can you give me a guarantee? Guarantee, so the noun, it's at the end, uh, is guaranteed, also at the end. It's guaranteed. Guarantee, guaranteed. Okay, the next one. Uragan разрушил сотни домов. The hurricane destroyed hundreds of homes. Uragan, hurricane. Ha, ha, first syllable, hurricane, open your mouth. You won't get a good ha if you don't open your mouth. Hurricane, the hurricane destroyed hundreds of homes. Hurricane, if you know about football, you may know that there is a famous footballer called Harry Kane, and his name really does sound quite a lot like hurricane. Harry Kane, hurricane. His parents probably thought of that when they named him. Harry Kane, hurricane. Good name for a famous person. Uh, next. Вам нужна лицензия на владение оружием. Лицензия is a license. You need a license to own a gun. Or to own a, a weapon. A license. Лицензия. A l open your mouth. License. The next one. На прошлой неделе я был в опере. I went to the opera last week. The opera. Two syllables. Opera. Opera. You don't need to pronounce the middle one. Opera. No. Opera. Opera. I went to the opera. The opera. And here we have the opera. The opera. The opera. You can really hear the y uh, between the and opera in this sentence. The opera. The opera. Next. Мой сын переживает трудную фазу своей жизни. Фаза is a phase. My son is going through a difficult phase in his life. Phase. A lot of y in that word. Phase. 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 What are the phases do people have? Let's have a look. Phase. 
adjectives before and maybe after as well. So it's a new phase. This is the final, this is the final phase of the project. Not I see, no. I said this is the final phase. We are currently in the initial phase of construction. Um, uh, this is the acute phase. So in healthcare, the acute phase is the most serious, the most serious phase. So if it's an acute phase um, of the disease, then that's the, the most, the most serious phase, acute. And the last word in today's lesson, мне нравится ритм, хип-хоп музыки. Ритм is rhythm. I love the rhythm in hip-hop music. Here, voice typing is useful because it's hard to remember how this word is spelt. R-H-Y-T-H-M, like what is that about? Anyway, we say rhythm. So we say rhythm, rhythm, rhythm. With a nice long r at the beginning. Rhythm. The rhythm. I love the rhythm. Uh, the adjective would be, if I can spell it, rhythmic. Rhythmic. Uh, so rhythm, rhythmic. Rhythm, rhythmic. And that's all. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this little pronunciation lesson uh, with words which should be familiar to you. Um, this is the penultimate предпоследний урок. Um, so I hope you will join me soon to watch the last one. If you've made it this far, you should really make it to the end. See you soon.